Oh, you didn't know? That's right, I do play the guitar and sing and write songs. It's something I'm passionate about and I got to share my new song, Maybe It's a Dream, here on this channel. That was the video right before this one was published. Now we're back to the normal good stuff. Oh yeah, not, and I'm not editing this video like I had the last couple. That's something I love to edit videos, but I know that in reality, some of the most engaging videos I'm gonna do are gonna be longer and unedited and very imperfect. Like, like the days when we would actually talk to each other on the phone and have these conversations. That's what a lot of my videos are, you know? So here's what I wanna talk about today. <laughs> I'm, as usual, setting myself up to, uh, for people uh, from outside of America to comment, you stupid, ignorant American. <laughs> That's kind of like a theme of a lot of my videos, isn't it? So here's, here's what I'm sorting out right now. Okay, I want to talk about Southern Europe. Southern Europe. Yes, all of you know my story by now. My mom, who's half Italian descent, ends up being 2% according to my heritage DNA. My sister is, I think, shows something about the same. Barely Italian. I show no Italian. My dad shows no Italian. So, you know. Uh, and everybody on my mom's side of the family on the Italian side is the same way. They hardly show any Italian at all, and instead they show Middle Eastern and Sephardic Jewish. Sometimes uh, other uh, strands of, of the Jewish Jewish, but Sephardic is what my mom shows. And so here's the perspective that gives me. Here, here's what I think about when I when I say those things out loud. So for me. As an American, when I think about Southern Europe, especially when I think about Italy, when I think about Greece, when I think about Spain and Portugal, I think, okay, they're kind of a mixed race. Oh, man, look what I just did. I just got 13 dislikes just then when I said that, and three of you are gonna send rants to me in the comments section for what I just said. When I implied that I feel that Southern Europe, the people from Southern Europe feel a little bit of a mixed race. Mixed race, and yes, race is an arbitrary word made to only divide people instead of bring them together. But that's what I like to do in these videos is I like to break down those invisible lines and those barriers and unpack them. And, and as an individual human being who is of definitely of mixed race because, you know, the Amerindian thing with my mom being of Mexican descent, you know, like 21% of me being, uh, you know, Native American via Mexico. But specifically, when I think of Southern Europe, I, I think of people who are truly a mixed race. Whatever exactly that is going to entail. So again, when I think of places like Italy, Spain, Greece, I think of these are places for hundreds of years, for thousands of years, where people crossed through and mixed and there were war and there were people marrying into different races, maybe to escape their own out of their own race and identity and all these things that happened. So then my mom takes her DNA test and she was proud to be half Italian descent and realizes that that's only 2% because that's how much mixing that was going on in the part of Italy where they came from. Sesame, I, I'm mispronouncing it, something like that. It's in Southern Italy. So, okay, well let's, let's unpack what I just said. So it, would that make the Italian side of my mom a mixed race within itself? I mean, you know, if you're 2% Italian and you're 15.2% uh, Sephardic Jewish and then there's something like 14% Middle Eastern and then there's 2% African in there. So, I mean, by default, if, with my mom being of African descent, even if it's just a little bit, still, uh, you know, that, that, but that, goes back to why I see Southern Europe is just kind of a mixed race part of Europe. Just, that's what it is. Northwestern Europe, it's different. You know, that's where my dad's side 
that's where his, my dad traces back to. That's so in theory, half of my DNA is that, you know, but even if my mom wasn't quote half Mexican, Oh no, I said it again. Some of you can't stand it when I say half Mexican, but yes, <laughs> I'm having too much fun. Cause I know like the American audience over here totally follows everything I say. Like, Oh yeah, that sounds right. And then everybody else in the rest of the world, like you, Making me cringe, uh, rant. Uh, I gotta do a, a face palm. Uh. It's just, it's fun. It's fun because I know that, like, I can't just have a normal conversation. I already know what's gonna happen in the comment section. But for me, it's important that I am real and honest, and I am not apologetic in how I explain my perspective as an American. So, <sighs> Southern Europe. I look at Southern Europe as more of a mixed race of people. Yes, they're European and yes, they're white. In the same sense, my mom is white. <laughs> and when I made the video where I asked her if she believed, if she saw herself as a white woman, she said, no, you know, my mom does not identify as a white woman, even though in the, on paper she is according to most people. Right. But, uh, and what's funny too is that I got more of the DNA from the, you know, Central American DNA than, than even she did. And we both went through my heritage. I know these tests aren't perfect. They're a scam. They're a hoax, right? All that good stuff. Uh, but still, it's very interesting to me that if, if anything, here's what I'm trying to say. That Southern Europe is more representative. Repre I should edit this video. I'm not going to. But Southern Europe represents more of really who I feel like I am, my sister and, and my mom are. We're, we could, you could put us in Southern Europe and we fit right in if you, the way you look at us. My dad, maybe not so much. My dad to me doesn't look specifically English or something, even though he largely is. Uh, but my dad is a mix of all those things in Northern Europe. And my sister and I, if anything, came out looking more like those features from our mom. So anyway, that's a mixed bag of things I, I said, but ultimately that's, that's just, it's what I've been thinking about the last couple days and I wanted to make a video and just say it. Southern Europe is ethnically mixed. It's white, but it's ethnically mixed. Like me, like my mom, like my sister, not so much when you're looking at Northwestern Europe, for example. What are your thoughts on that? Remember, how many dislikes are there supposed to be? There's supposed to be 13, and then and there's supposed to be three comments of people telling me I'm a stupid American. And go.